you all know chitti robot right uh, you might have seen the chitti robot in the movie called robot here chitti robot is a knowledge machine it knows everything that it has been trained it has been trained with multiple things and it is well versed with all of the things that it has been trained so why i'm saying this chat gpt is exactly like the chitti robot it can do any task based on the training that it have been received from open ai but it is not a news medium people often complain that chat gpt cannot uh, retrieve the latest data because like to retrieve the latest data we have news sources right we have news mediums we have many blogs out there which will provide daily news but the purpose of chat gpt is not that it is a knowledge machine it is like the chitti robot that i mentioned it knows everything you you ask something you name something it will tell you the answer based on that even the physical task you might see like chat gpt will only give you answers how can it perform physical task if you build a robot and if you have the integration with open ai's api then ultimately because of the knowledge that it has with everything it might be uh, kickboxing it might be running it might be cycling because it has the knowledge of how to do that and if you give the knowledge to the robot that you have built it will do that the reason why i'm making this video is many people are not aware of how to use chat gpt the right way people are using it just for fun and many asked me that how to use the chat gpt the right way because we are asking something and chat gpt is giving something that's fine but how to make the most out of it it is what exactly i'm going to cover in this video the first thing if you are new to chat gpt if you don't know what chat gpt is if you search for chat gpt in the internet you will find the link chat, chat gpt is a model a generative ai model which is built by open ai it can answer your queries based on the knowledge that it has been trained the data that it has been trained so it is a knowledge machine so to say it in a simple words it is similar to chitti robot like if you ask anything based on the data that it has it can uh, give you answers similarly if you upload any book like in the robo movie if you upload any book and ask questions based on that chat gpt will give you answers in seconds so that is the power of chat gpt now how to use chat gpt the right way so before going into that let's first set up few things in chat gpt to make the most out of it you might be using chat gpt already but you might have not been aware of this let's open chat gpt now so this is the chat gpt console uh, if you already i believe you already aware of it so the first thing that you need to do is setting up the custom instructions so in the in the bottom left there you will see if you click the i mean three dots there you will see my blend custom instruction settings and beta just click custom instructions it is very important thing i will explain why it is here there are two fields that you need to fill the first thing is what would you like chat gpt to know about you to provide better responses it is something that most of the people uh, are not using it properly uh, the reason why you need to add here is because if you provide what you are what you are expecting from chat gpt in general what you do your job or your studies if you mention all your details here from the next time if you ask something chat gpt will keep all those information in mind before replying to you so that you will get customized responses based on your profile so that is thing that is very important and the second section is how would you like chat gpt to respond so this is very important i have also made a complete video on it one prompt to convert chat gpt into a personal assistant it is what the video that i have made uh, previously so uh, this is the prompt that you just need to copy the prompt there from that video and you just need to paste here this prompt basically will act as an expert in whatever you are asking in general uh, the purpose of this field is how would you like chat gpt to respond right so if you ask something how you want chat gpt to respond to your query so if you just copy and paste this command here you will uh, get this prompt in that video itself or i will try to paste that in the description as well so if you are done with these two then custom instruction part is done and most importantly the magic prompt the prompt in the second field is very important because i will tell you why it is important i have also shared in a previous video but i will also tell so this is the first part now how to use chat gpt the right way in general we can use chat gpt for three different purposes i am uh, i mean uh, segregating them into three parts the first part is learning second part is work and third part is earning these three are important so firstly how to use chat gpt for learning let's suppose here i am asking chat gpt uh, to help me learn data analytics by providing the 14 day road map so this is a prompt that i am asking and as i said like i have used the prompt uh, in the custom instructions right one one field i have used that right that is called magic prompt so because of the prompt that i have used there 
so it is uh, asking me few more questions in general if you ask chat gpt directly something like this help you learn data analytics by providing the 14 day roadmap it will directly give you the 14 day roadmap that's it you are done but it won't be much clear as how it is now so you need to use that in custom instructions uh, for sure now for learning like i asked a learning roadmap for data analytics and it asked me five different questions are you a complete beginner in data analytics i said i am a complete beginner what tools of programming languages are you familiar with i said python what is your primary motivation for learning data analytics i said to upgrade in my career and how much time you can commit per day for 14 day roadmap i said 6 hours per day and do you have any specific topics that you are interested in i said no, i have no idea about it so because like i try i tried acting a very naive very beginner level so that chat gpt will give me more uh, beginner friendly content so yeah it is it's again like uh, re revising me like what are the things that i have mentioned and i confirmed that and it said it will break down the data analytics for me into a 14 day roadmap plan and it gave me all the topics that i need to focus on to data uh, to learn data analytics in the beginning i confirmed that and it's also giving me having high level information on that next it gave me the 14 day roadmap every roadmap it gave me like what are the topics that i need to mention and all and if i click if i proceed on that then ultimately i will get more information as well let's suppose if i ask uh, give me give me the more detailed roadmap so I, it, it gave me uh, the roadmap that i asked for it also uh, assigned some hours for it so that i can plan my uh, i mean plan my learning preparation and all next i have asked it to give me some more detailed roadmap so it is not enough for me i wanted to see in more detail let's see how chart gpt will give if you want to see you can also see the background work that it is giving uh, it is uh, doing there now it gave me the complete roadmap for day one in a more detailed way it said like introduction to data analytics what are the activities that i need to do and what are the resources that uh, i need to use and all it asked me like um, i mean would you like to proceed with similar roadmap for all the days i said yes now it's giving me a complete detailed roadmap for all the days give me activities resources and all and it's also asking me whether i want something like a downloadable resource for it i said yes so it give me some document kind of thing so that i can download it and i can use it as well so it is how you can learn anything using chat gpt just use that magic prompt under custom instructions and ask anything with chat gpt follow their inputs give more details about what you are willing to achieve so that you will get proper response from chat gpt yeah it gave me uh, the downloadable uh, format as well and just clicking download file has been downloaded already just opening it to see what yeah it gave me a complete document see it hardly takes two to three minutes right so i mean the, the, my conversation starts around and i just asked the downloadable resource it suggested me like i didn't even ask it that and it gave me uh, the downloadable resource so it is how you should learn anything using chart gpt and next thing is work how to use work so similar to how you have used it for learning how you have used it chat gpt for learning you can also save a lot of time during work personally i am saving a lot of time in my work both professional and personal using chat gpt similarly like uh, the way that we use it for learning if you are i mean if you are researching for something or it might be coding or it might be marketing uh, it might be any other thing so just ask chat gpt and explain the issue more in more detail it will give you more detail and accurate answers so if it's gpt4 if you are a plus user then it would be more uh, beneficial for you because it will give you more accurate answers and speed answers as well you can use features like advanced data analytics and plugins to extract more out of it so it is how you can use chat gpt for work as well the advantage is it will help you to save a lot of time and i am doing that as well i am saving a lot of time and that is the reason why i am able to manage a lot of things and other thing is earning how to use chat gpt for earning because you can learn things you can work using chat gpt other important thing is earning there are different ways you can become a freelancer in whatever you are good at let's suppose you are a content writer become a freelancer in registered platforms like fever or even in linkedin you can reach out to brands because chat gpt can help you save your time 
save your time a lot you can easily do your work in less time than how it used to be uh, without chat gpt so that you can manage your work you can manage freelancing part as well you can earn money there you can also earn money by selling chat gpt prompts i have already made a video earlier on how you can earn money by selling chat gpt prompts so it's it's basically like you feel like you discovered a future on chat gpt or you tried asking chat gpt one and it gave you complete road map so you can sell this from something like this like if you want a 14 day road map for any technology uh, buy this prompt and you can also set some price for that i i have showed you clearly on uh, that video you can check the link in the description as well and there are other ways as well apart from freelancing apart from selling prompts you can uh, do multiple gigs you can take multiple gigs uh, gigs as freelancing and that that is something that will help if you are or teaching something you can create an outline you can also sell some uh, pdfs and all like it might be materials so if you are a student you can create a material using chat gpt study material of a particular subject using chat gpt and you can sell on platforms like gumroad so there are many different ways that you can earn using chat gpt i have already made many of the videos so i don't want to go into detail on that earning part but this is how you can use chat gpt to make the most out of it I hope it helps and if you want to master chat gpt i wrote two books one is the prompt engineering one and the one is a chat gpt prompt sheet you will find uh, both of those books links in the description those will be very helpful for you if you can have them handy you can perform any task easily i suggest go through them once and uh, for if possible purchase them uh, they were not really costly as well i hope this video will help and it will provide you some insights at least i believe share this video in your network if you feel someone would get benefit out of it also like and don't forget to subscribe to the channel if you are a new visitor thank you for watching